Hey guys, this is Amit. Welcome to another Notepad++ Tips and Tricks. In today's video, we are going to learn how you can add Firefox and Google Chrome web browsers in Notepad++ on Windows 10 machine. Now, if you have been using Notepad++ for many years, you might know that in order to view uh, HTML files uh, in, in different web browser, let's say Google Chrome or Mozilla Firefox in Notepad++, Previously, you had to create these custom run commands, and usually it was used to be right here. And so you will manually add one entry for each web browser, and that's how you can actually, you know, preview or view uh, an HTML file right from Notepad++. Well, the good news is with the recent update in Notepad++, we don't need to do that. These options are already added, but it has place in a little different place. And so we just need to be aware of that. Now, currently I'm using Notepad++ version 7.9.1 uh, with the build in November 2020. And so if you're using an older version, you might not see these options. So let's take a look at where these options are. And so if you go to View and go to View Current File In, Actually now, not only you have a Google Chrome and Firefox, but you also have Microsoft Edge and our old trusty Internet Explorer, a legacy Internet Explorer web browser. And so with just a click of a button, uh, you can open your HTML file in all these four web browser, Google Chrome, Mozilla Firefox, Internet Explorer, and Microsoft Edge. And so you can test your code uh, HTML code in all these web browsers and just to make sure how it looks like. All right, so let's take a look at one of the HTML file that I have. Uh, it's right here. And in order to view this, let's say in a Google Chrome, we need to go to view, go to view current file in and just select this option. And that's about it. It is as simple as that with just a click, it is able to open my HTML file in Google Chrome. And you can just preview it. Now, if I want to see the same code in, let's say, Firefox, so I can go to View, View Current File In, and Firefox, and right here, you can see that it was also able to open this HTML file in Firefox. Now, in order for these actually functions to work, you must have Mozilla Firefox installed or Google Chrome installed. Uh, Microsoft Edge and Internet Explorer comes uh, installed default in Windows machine. And so let's say I would like to open the same code in Internet Explorer. Uh, perhaps you are using some HTML code with the legacy stuff in it and it needed to be supported in Internet Explorer so you can test that out also. So I'm going to click on this and as you can see, it is able to open this web uh, uh, HTML file in Internet Explorer. So that's about it for this video. Uh, we just learned how we can very easily open this, uh, you know, Firefox or Google Chrome web browser from Notepad++. And we don't need to have a special custom commands. So that's about it for this video. If you like this video, please click the like button. And uh, please subscribe to my channel to get more videos about Notepad++. And thank you very much.